both so both are maths so you have to know both okay so um abd abd is uh, you have to add a line okay so abd is this one no, okay this. so they ask you to prove this abd is equal to this cd okay so they ask you to prove this so how you prove is okay we make use of this tangent called theorem okay so how to how to read on your own next time is so if this is the angle right so you it, it's on the left so you you read this direction to the third angle okay, okay? so right next to it that one is called the first angle which is the first then you, you you read like this right yeah therefore this will be the second angle so this is the third angle so therefore this one is equal to the third angle okay so similarly if you look from the right hand side in this case so this is the angle okay so you read from anti-clockwise direction yeah so right next to it is the one okay so this is the two so therefore this is the three so this angle is go to this angle okay so this is called tangent called theorem. very easy to remember so therefore if you look at this okay so this one is okay this one yeah this one if you um if you um look from this side right so right next to it this is the one and this is the two and this is the three so uh the, if this is the angle three this is angle three you know yeah. right because they have to be equal according to tangent cord theorem and now if you look from it from this side so you look from this side right mm -hmm. so this is your one this is your two this is your three so therefore this angle is actually equals to this angle Okay. okay with tangent cord theorem and next so this angle is also 3 because of your z yeah alternating angle yeah alternate huh? alternate angle okay because they are parallel lines right yeah so therefore this is 3 this is 3 so therefore you can prove they are equal so okay what's the reasoning like usually have which one uh, uh okay so the this the first one is tangent cord theorem tangent cord theorem the, so ad, the other one is alternate angle okay. tangent cord theorem so just write that in the bracket yeah okay. for the first one then for the second one is uh, alternate angle then then therefore uh, this is equal to this okay. okay and then over here abd is congruent abd versus abd abd is this one right yeah okay and then i uh, see c so it's, it's this one okay so to prove congruency so you have sss so you have sas you also have aas what else that's pretty much yeah okay so um you have already proven that um yeah already proven that this angle three is angle two angle three yeah so yeah so basically you you, you focus your attention on this also they also like given that uh, right so you have the side right you have the side right yeah so now you need to prove like uh, one more um one more angle then you can use aas already or maybe so which angle you you, you can use to uh, prove that okay which one